Scattered showers and thunderstorms will be possible across central Texas tonight. From now through about midnight, we are looking at the... I can't say that. This is recorded. Let's look at your future track as we head through tonight. Through the midnight hour, we could see more showers and thunderstorms developing. Some of those could be strong to severe with hail and wind the main threat. And we could see some locally heavy rain as well, which could lead to a few flooding problems. So make sure you take it easy if you're going to be out tonight. As we head into Saturday morning, that pushes to the east. Maybe a few showers left over, especially from I-35 to the east in the morning hours. But notice what happens in the afternoon. This shows a couple of lingering showers and storms that may be a little overdone here. I think partly cloudy skies for the most part and temperatures rising into the upper 70s. So hopefully we can keep the storms out of here as we head into Saturday night on into Sunday morning and look at this Sunday afternoon storm free the way it looks right now. Future rain amounts. Well, as that next line moves in, we could be looking at one to two inches in a few places with some locally higher totals possible. So that's something to keep an eye on as we head through the overnight hours tonight. Remember, if you come to an area where water covers the road, turn around and don't drown. As we make our way into Saturday, a few morning showers possible, then starting to come to an end with the sunshine coming out in the afternoon. 83 on Sunday, same for Monday, but notice this. Thunderstorm chances back in the forecast by Monday afternoon and evening. That could go into Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday as well. As a cold front gets closer to the area, that will cool us down by the end of next week going into the next weekend with still some lingering rain chances. Now, it's not going to rain constantly next week, but there will be on and off periods of showers and thunderstorms from time to time. Keep it right here on First Alert Central Texas. I'm Chief Meteorologist Matt Hines. I hope you have a great weekend.